Eighth experiment is finding the maximum and minimum element in a given array. So press Control N or Control N or New VI. Control T to align. We need to find maximum element and minimum in a given array. So right click uh, for this particular experiment. Right click in the black diagram panel. So first one is structures, second one is array. This is numeric. So we need to perform array operations. Now. So click on array. And first one is array size, array index, replace, uh, build array, array subset, maximum min. We need to find maximum and minimum in array now. So click on max and min. After that, left side we have one orange color dot, and the right side we have max value below color, blue color is max index. Next to orange is my min value. Fourth one is min index. So for this we need to create left side we need to create input. So right click create control. Create control. First one is constant, second one is control. So it will create array. Here also you can see. So how many elements you can give that you can decide by go to this front panel okay go to in the middle here come down like this or can also go to right side so right side i think it's not possible uh, right side also it's possible so either right side or horizontally or vertically you can increase number of elements uh, i created uh, five so similarly here Okay, first orange button, right click, create indicator. Next to blue color, next orange color, create indicator. It will show. minimum value so now i want to give some values for this so i will give random values any random values for example 23 37 12 okay. then 250 then 30 Five. Like any random values you can give. So now in this given array, the maximum element is 250 and minimum is 12. So let us verify whether we are getting or not. So now run this. See, maximum is coming as 250, minimum is coming as 12. Okay. Similarly, if we want to give some, uh, this is actually orange, no? Orange means it is uh, actually supporting uh, floating point or decimal point. So I can give fraction values also. Like this. Now if we run, we'll show floating point uh, decimals here because this is are in orange color if i change this one to new uh, integer i think uh, you are not going to get fractions values See here automatically it is rounded to next integer 250.99 it is rounded to 251 similarly this also if you change this one to it is changes to 12.1 is rounded to 
12 only okay and suppose this one also if you change this one to integer the fraction it will not take understand so next if i want to find uh, which in a array in which position actually the maximum and minimum is there yeah, i can give minus value also minus 23 then check it out minimum value is minus 23 i can find out at which position it is actually a maximum number is coming in array the first one is zeroth element first element second element third and fourth if total five are there you have to start from zero place zero place first place second and third and fourth you can index that value you can check it out so to implement that also the second button in the max and uh, array max and minimum block second one is create indicator it will show the maximum number indication okay max index similarly fourth button in the right side minimum index there right click create indicator and that you can place here so expected output is what expected output is maximum element we given as 251 which is at 0 1 2 3 in third position the index value is 3 should come here and minimum 0 1 so one should come in the minimum index this is the first one is zero next one is one two three four so now let us check whether it is coming or not see maximum value is 251 the index is three zero one two three and minimum value is minus 23 its position is zero and one zero place is 26 first place is 23 second is 12 so fourth place is 251 so index value is 1 for minimum is 20 minus 23 is present at the first position that is after the 0th and maximum value 251 is present at the uh, third position of array starting from 0, 1, 2, 3. 